Sussex mad as hell. Chelsea Davy blows Harry up ruthlessly mocking him over stupid comments to Kate. Chelsea Davy offered a shy smile after ripping up her then-boyfriend Prince Harry's best man speech that complimented his sister-in-law Kate Middleton's killer legs, unearthed accounts show. The 36-year-old has remained tight-lipped after her seven-year romance with Harry ended following Kate's nuptials, but questions of her relationship with the royal have continued to be asked. She and Harry, who is now married to former actress Meghan Markle, began their time together in 2004, enjoying what some observers called a real love match. Her influence over the then-labeled reckless royal, a prince regarded as much for his partying as he was for his philanthropy, was noticeable to those closest to Harry. This included on the day Harry delivered his best man's speech at brother Prince William's spectacular wedding to Kate nearly eleven years ago. There was also a line in his speech that also made Kate cry, Ms. Nickel noted, adding, when he said the couple's decade-long romance was his inspiration, there was a shy smile from Chelsea, while Kate shed a tear. The speech was peppered with Harry's classic sense of humor, and he ribbed his brother, William didn't have a romantic bone in his body before he met Kate, so I knew it was serious when William suddenly started cooing down the phone at her. Famous for his mimicry, Harry then impersonated his brother calling Kate Babykins, to much laughter from the guests. Royal author Robert Lacey, in his 2020 book Battle of Brothers, William, Harry and the Inside Story of a Family in Tumult, revealed, though, that this witnessing the union of Kate and William would spell the end of Chelsea's involvement with the prince. He wrote, in 2011, after more comings and goings, she finally decided to go, and it was, ironically, Kate and William's grand and glorious wedding that spring that did it for her. This was reiterated by fellow author Angela Levin, who noted that Chelsea's reaction to the spectacular event had shown her how different the couple's lives were. Writing in Harry, Conversations with the Prince, Ms. Levin added, a friend revealed that seeing the enormity and pomp of the day convinced Chelsea that she and Harry had been right to separate. Although they had a lot in common, she saw clearly that because they came from such different worlds it could never have worked especially as she valued her privacy and guarded it so carefully. Prior to their relationship breakdown, the likes of astrologer Penny Thornton, who worked closely with Harry's mother Diana, were convinced the pair would eventually tie the knot. She noted how they appeared to have a strong bond during Amazon Prime's William and Kate into the future documentary. Ms. Thornton added, astrologically, they are a perfect match, a match like Kate and William, and it's hard for me to see how he will replace her, Chelsea, with anyone else. This assessment was also noted by royal author Richard Kay, who described their relationship as a real love match. He described the great passion between the two of them when they're together, and added, the tension is visible, there's electricity, there's sparks flying everywhere. You can tell though they have a very volatile relationship, tremendous shouting matches, screaming rows, but then they get back together again. I would say that of all the royal romances currently going on, theirs was the real true thing, it's the real deal. And I suspect unless something catastrophic happens, they will marry. But it'll be a very tempestuous marriage. After splitting, the pair remained close, with Zimbabwean-born Chelsea even attending Harry and Meghan's nuptials three years ago. Earlier, Kate Middleton on Tuesday arrived in Denmark on a two-day visit. It's her first visit foreign visit since the pandemic begin. The Duchess of Cambridge visited the Copenhagen Infant Mental Health Project at the University of Copenhagen as her first engagement of Denmark tour. As Prince William's wife arrived in Denmark, photographs of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex dining with Princess Eugenie appeared on a US gossip website. Royal expert and TV personality Richard Eden, while commenting of Sussex's pictures, wrote on Twitter, Coincidence? Photographs of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex dining with Princess Eugenie appear on a US gossip website on the very day that the Duchess of Cambridge is making her first foreign visit since the